Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Electon TV. For today, troubleshooting experience that I want to share in this video, guys, is about CO2 fire extinguisher system alarm. And the trouble, guys, one of the air horn was activated or the alarm was activated on the cargo hold number two. And but when we check the cargo hold number two, there's no sign of smoke and fire inside. But the air horn was activated, and that's the our trouble, guys. So in this video, I show you what's the reason and what's happened. And before I start, guys. I just want to say uh, thank you to all of my subscribers because now we are uh, 908 so if you like my content or uh, my videos please guys it was a pleasure to me if you share my video or my youtube channel to other electricians or ETO also Okay, to my subscribers, thank you. Okay guys, now we are here in the cargo hold number 2. Here guys, the air horn. From here, I didn't see anything. Or anything, any electrical or mechanical that activate this air horn and now guys here is the fire extinguishing system alarm of the CO2 here is the signal lamp if the cargo hold CO2 alarm is activated lamp test it's okay now you see there's no light that's why it's not activated from the alarm system open let's check what happened or maybe some one of the relays activate or defective here is the diagram guys while in draw of co to release alarm here in the diagram guys we are uh, number 11 12 you follow the line SBCO2 number 2 cargo hold horn from here guys we have a solenoid bulb SB solenoid bulb and the terminal is 11 and 12 in the X4 okay that's the thing that we need to check solenoid bulb maybe the solenoid bulb is activated Okay guys, we need to find the export. So that's the export terminal. And number 11 and number 12 export. As you see, the export is at the back. And here 9, 10. What we need to check is 11 and 12. So here is the 11 and 12. Based in the manual, the supply of the solenoid bulb is 220 so we need to check if they have a uh, 220 volts power okay. 11 and 12 220 volts AC so zero guys so there's no power supply And, uh, let's try to check the coil if it's good or no so we go to ohm because it's a coil 
we have a uh, 30 ohm so I think guys is the coil is good and we need to find where is that solenoid bulb and okay guys here guys I found the drawing for all system of the air system pipelines Here guys to compress air system so here is the pipeline that's the horn for the cargo hold number one and the solenoid valve is here for the cargo hold number one the problem guys is the from the cargo hold number two so here is the air horn and the solenoid valve is here based on the drawing the solenoid valve was in the number 5 side void P port side so in the void space port side okay that's the place that we need to check where it is and how to go there the thing that we need to find out I think the solenoid bulb is damaged or defective that's why the air pass and the horn is activated okay Okay guys, we are here in the engine room workshop and that's the pipeline for air to CO2 alarm cargo hold. So now guys, we close that bulb to stop the air horn because it's too loud. And that's the void space that we need to open because in the drawing, the solenoid bulb was inside of the void space okay and now we already open guys let's go inside and check where is that solenoid bulb oh second cover too far it's in the middle of the it's in the midship here guys is the solenoid bulb for number one air horn the number two was there motorized bulb for ballasting okay let's go there And now guys here is the solenoid bulb that we need to check to remove guys and uh, if we have a spare maybe better to replace and now guys here the solenoid bulb that are uh, removed and we already opened guys uh, the problem guys is they have some uh, dust inside and so much dirty we already reconditioned only because we don't have a spare on board and we already test and now it's good and now we put back and uh, let's see what's happened now guys we already put back 
sorry my bag let's uh, open the air bag and let's check and now guys we already put back everything we open the bulb and now here again in the cargo hold number two let's check the air horn and now guys the horn is uh, not activated there's no sound and it's work normal okay problem solved that's it for today guys and I hope you learned something again in this video and please don't forget to subscribe and like my video and also share thank you guys for watching